Yo, hello everyone and welcome back again to a brand new video. Creative Minds, today we are diving into Art Breeder, your great way to endless artistic possibilities. Follow along as we navigate the basics and unleash the creative potential of Art Breeder for generating stunning visuals and artwork. So guys, let's get started. So before we start with this video, make sure to watch it from now till the end so you have the full information. First thing first guys is to go ahead and open artbreeder.com by going to their official website. Right after you do so, this is the website as you can see and basically as you can get it from the name, this AI will try to generate and create characters, artworks and more with multiple tools powered by AI. So even you can manage to mix stuff together and even change gender. So in this video, we are going to learn how to use this tool for our uh, basics daily uses. So the first thing that you can see is the feature tools. So first of all, we have Mixer. Create by mixing images and text together. So here, as you can see, there was kind of like a cat or a lion and a girl. And as you can see, a girl heard in a tiger cub and this was the thing that was turned into. Here, Tanner, create images with fine-tuned control. Here we have patterns. Combine a pattern and a description to make an image. As you can see here, there is like a chess board that has been merged with an artistic old house from medieval time and many more as you can see here a lot of mix that has been done in here like there is a lot of images each one of them has been merged together to give us this beautiful image so now to get to use this ai we first of all have to sign up so let's click right here and as you can see sign up for free so we can create an account just by using our gmail account click on continue and we will be right there as you can see this is exactly what we wanted here we have the tools so now we have created our account successfully so here we have all the tools we have poser mixer prompter toner collager uh, splicer patterns and out painter so in this video guys we are going to use each one of them so let's start first with the simple one the prompter so here we are going to turn a text into an image to do so we have we are going to simply give a description here so describe your image just make me for example uh, a lonely sad white cat with blue yellow eyes walking uh, on the roof of a mid mid evil house at night and let's see what is it gonna be generating for us so there we go this is the image and as you can see, this is exactly the cat. Of course, it's not going to be as perfect as you might think. So here I'm going to ask it to give me five more images. So it can actually train itself more. We can here change the size of the image. We can make it as variation as we want it. So here we simply have to wait and they will give us the rest of the images that we have selected. So here the number of images and here you will see the cost credits because here we have credits and you have a limited amount of credits. So each time you try to generate a, an image, a credit will be used to generate it. You have as like a normal account you don't have a limited amount of credits so you simply have to go here go to accounts and as you can see this is the credit balance this is how much you have so we have now around 3.97 credit balance so this is the amount of credit that we own let's refresh now and as you can see once we have created these five images it was reduced to 2.88 from 2.97 to 2.988 i think the total that comes with to you as a started credit balance it is three as you can see refill to three on june 14 so here they are going to fulfill it each month so you can keep up with it uh, here these are the images and yeah this is basically for the prompter we have here the mixer so we can go here with new image and we can choose for example here to 
like mix two different images so here i'm going to go ahead and search for example for naruto picture so i'm going here for an anime picture i'm going to use this one and basically i'm going to use this one so two images of naruto so there we go i'm going to use them and let's try to mix them together um, i'm going to use upload an image i'm going to download and i'm going to use this one i'm going to do the same thing add a new image upload image and use the other one and now let's try to generate they are going to try to mix these two together and give us one image at a time so now we have given them an amount of three so there we go now they have tried to mix the style of this first image into the second image and here you can choose how much balance you would like to have so for example i want to have the style of this image more than the other i can reduce it like that so it can be less affecting on this image here also we can choose the size of it we can choose the account which is basically how many images i would like to have and this is the price of the credit that you are going to pay to have this amount of images it changes depending on how many images you want to have and of course the quality of the image the bigger size the bigger resolution the bigger or the higher the price is gonna cost you of course the price is still low for 0.7 for six images it's still very good now for you guys to know if you would like to go and upgrade your plan now we need to know what are the prices so here we have for the starter you have nine dollars for a hundred credits per month it's gonna be extras with google drive synchronization privacy controls and custom generations here we have the advantage with 275 credit per month and the champion with 40 dollar a month it's gonna give you around 700 credits you know 700 credits it's a very very high amount of credit to use in this website so unless you were gonna use it to create thousands of images per month i do not suggest you to go for the champion one so the free one is more than enough for me as someone who can just create a couple of images maybe 10 maybe 15 at maximum range but for those who want more around 100 image or 200 you could go for starter or either advanced for you who want to take it as professional and further as you want you could go simply for the champion and the actual extras that's gonna be given to you for advanced and champion they are the same as the ones in the starter at the same time guys make sure to notice that this one is in the yearly plan if you uh, on the monthly plan if we change it to the yearly plan there will be a couple dollars that's gonna be missing so for example for the champion it went down from 93 dollars into 31 dollar and yeah this is basically it guys for today's video thanks a lot and see you guys in the next tutorial